Angela Lavender said that it was not up to King Charles to remove Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's royal titles. Harry and Meghan have come under renewed criticism for continuing to benefit from their royal titles. It has been reported that the couples are worried about the titles being removed following the release of Harry's forthcoming memoir, Spare. GB News host Nana Akua asked whether Charles would ever strip the couple of their titles. Ms. Levin explained, No, I don't think he will ever do that. It is not up to him. It has to come from Parliament. There has to be a vote for it. He can't just say off with their titles. He can't do that. I think, as a father he loves a son, and he did get on well with Megan. He will not suddenly say that's it. The royal biographer continued, but, I do believe if the book that is coming out attacks them all. She and Harry are in for something. But it would have to be a significant nastiness for that to happen. Mzakua responded, so the public could put a petition together to get their titles removed and get Parliament to look at that. Ms. Levine joked, let's do it. Shake on it. The pair shook hands agreeing to launch a petition to remove the couple's titles. The GB News host added, Write your book, make your money, do your thing, but don't do it trading as a royal member. Ms. Levin agreed, they hang on to their title as if it's the most important thing, but the monarchy doesn't have much importance to them. The couple have been criticized in the past for being billed at events as the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Royal historian Marlene Koenig has argued the focus should not be on removing titles, but rather how they are used. She pointed out that you can live in America and have a title, but that the elephant in the room is the use of the title and business. Both Meghan and Harry have already been stripped of their HRH titles, as well as various other royal patronages and affiliations later in the GB News interview. Ms. Levin also criticized Mike Tindall's upcoming appearance on I'm a Celebrity. She said that the star's decision to join the ITV reality show was distasteful and would not have happened if Queen Elizabeth was still alive. King Charles enjoys the same drink every night before dinner. His book will be damn squib if he doesn't include Meg's anger. Meghan you turned on royal titles after talks with Beatrice and Eugenie Kate's Christmas announcement sparks confusion among royal fans. Camilla is incredibly worried about impact of Harry's memoir.